right, everyone, I am going to show you how to take our gift with purchase that's coming up in just a couple of days in our winter promotion on Dece November 16th. And you know what? When it is a gift to your customers, you really want to wrap it and you want it to make it look like a present. Just don't throw it into their bag. And so these are for anybody that does a $40 or more purchase. But I want to show you how to make this bow because it is so fun. And once I have found out how to make these, I love them. Okay, anybody can do it. So what I did is I took the lip glosses that are coming out and I put them in a plastic, um, you know, a little cello bag. You can get these at um, my girlfriend's house, Nashville Wraps. You can go to, you know, sometimes the dollar store, but I put them in a little bag. And then I take different types of texture and tools. So I have some white tool. And if you guys have a Hobby Lobby near you, these are 50% off. These huge rolls, you get them for five bucks. It's going to be wonderful. I get them in every single color. So I have it here in a white and then I had a silver. And I don't think silver is at Hobby Lobby right now, but you can use any color. Then I have this fun raffia and I am going to just take it and I'm going to double it because I want it to be a little bit fuller. All right. So you don't really have to make anything exact because we're going to trim it up. And then I'm going to take just a fun other ribbon, okay? It's a different size. It has a little bit more of a texture to it. And I'm going to cut it at the same time. All right. So now I have my strips of ribbon, different colors, different sizes, different textures. And then I have my lip glosses in the bag. So if you have somebody to help you with this, it's a little bit easier. But I'm going to try to do it by myself because my helper is my cameraman right now. <laughs> so he's got his hands full. All right, so you just tie it in a bow, like I just did, or tie it in a knot. All right, spread that out a little bit, and then just do a, bow, a shoestring bow like you, if you were going to be tying your shoes. So it's just a regular bow, and you tie it, and you just want to try to keep it as tight as you can. Fluff this out again, make your, your loops tight, and then I just trim everything. Now, I can do this pretty much just by eyeing it, years of working in a fabric store, <laughs> but if you need to measure that, you can. And then I just come and I clip the loops. That's all you do, and then you just spread it out, just like that. Oh my gosh, you guys, you can do every color, size, be creative, but this is my go-to bow. Everything that I wrap now has a bow like this, and look, oh my gosh, wouldn't you love to get a gift like this?